there, welcome or welcome back. My name is Julie. Welcome to another Frugal Mama Reviews. We're at the end of my birthday week extravaganza. There were a couple of days where we were all sick, so we're not counting those. So we are at the end of my birthday week. And I had the funnest time this weekend with my sister. It was just the ultimate gift. She brought me a delicious cake. She is quite the baker. She's amazing. And we had the funnest time, the most fun, doing a photo shoot together. This video is sponsored by Jewel Girl. Come on, Jewel, like Julie. I was like, all right, we're gonna go for it. Sister and I worked together to pick out some clothes for her to model, and we just had so much fun. Fun. And now, before we jump into the photo shoot and show you the gorgeousness that is my sister Raquel, I'm just gonna tell you there are links in the video description with the lowest possible prices on these fantastic products. Thank you, Jewel Girl. Now, let's jump in and show you just how deliciously fabulous my sister is. We were able to get three gorgeous items. Oh my goodness. One was this just delightful jean vest jacket thing with all this blingity bling. Oh my God, is she not the cutest? most adorable. This is my baby sister. She's 10 years younger than me and she is just, she is my partner in all things fabulous. Lots of you know that we go to Disney together a lot. We're also, you know, coffee, <laughs> coffee buddies and we will be doing more coffee videos together, coffee reviews. That's all coming soon now that I am able to comfortably drive again and walk pretty short distances, but a lot more than I was able to walk even two weeks ago. Her and I have some adventures planned. I can hardly wait, but just look at this. I mean, it's gorgeous. We also picked out this fabulous sweater, and Raquel will tell you her thoughts on all of these products at the end of the video, so stay tuned for that. One note, though, on this sweater, and she will talk about it, but I'm just going to mention it here right now. Don't order down in size if you want it to look more like the way it looked in the picture on their website because if you order down thinking, oh, this is like a big ginormous tent sweater, no, it's not. No, it's not. In fact, maybe even order up a size if you want to have that just kind of boho, loose, very chic look that is in the picture. But it was so comfortable, really well made. Then, okay, this, I, I couldn't even believe that she was willing to do it because she's not someone that normally wears these kinds of just crazy, vibrant, super fun, just out there kinds of colors. But for me, she did it and I'm so grateful. I'm just so grateful that she came all the way down. She lives a ways away, but she came all the way down. She made me a birthday cake. We hung out for hours and hours and hours. We laughed. We cried. We just, well, I don't know that we really cried this time. Mostly we were laughing until we were crying and we just had the most amazing time with her being my model, me being the like director photographer of all of this and feeling very like professional. It felt really good. But anyway, there's this pink, like I wanted to call it like a shacket. <laughs> No, not a shack, um, because it's like a shirt jacket and it has this really fun fray going on, these like frayed bits and pieces, which actually was Raquel's favorite part of it. I really liked the construction. I liked the quality of the material. It was so much better than I had any right to expect. Definitely, I want to say that about the jean vest jacket thing as well. So well made. Like that's quality denim, which... I mean, I just wasn't expecting. I, I try to keep <laughs> my expectations somewhat low, <laughs> just in life in general, okay? So that I'm never totally disappointed. It's been a rough couple of years. You guys know this. You guys know it's been a rough couple of years at the Frugal family and for Frugal Mama Julie. So I keep my expectations low. And so then when things don't work out, it's like, oh, well, that's what I expected anyway. But then when they are just like fabulous, like the jean vest jacket thing, I mean, hello, awesome. So anyway, oh my God. So this pink, it looks so good. It looks so good. My, my sister is very chocolatey. I'm the whitey of the family very white. We are Mexican-American. We are halfies, you know, mixed race and all of that. And my Raquel got the just gorgeous, very, you know, fabulous light chocolate skin. And I mean, her hair, can you even, I mean, do I even need to say? I mean, I know you guys all already, you know, are noticing. Mm. The curls are all natural. She's had those since the day she was born. Well, I don't remember if she had very much hair when she was born. But anyhow, the pink with her just chocolatey fabulousness of skin, it just looks 
gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. And seriously, I couldn't believe that she was willing to wear that color because it's just really not kind of her normal thing. It looks so good on her and she enjoyed it too, which just makes it that much better, you know? And again, the quality of it, very nice. I really enjoyed it. These are some fantastic clothing items. So now let's talk to Raquel. Let's see what she thought of these goodies. Okay. <laughs> Initial thoughts. Of each one individually? Overall. Overall. I like them. I like the style. Okay. Um, this one in particular... I like the beading. I didn't think I would because I don't normally like pearls and things like that. But with the distressed, it adds like, not fancy, but style. And it balances. Yeah. They balance each other. So I really like that. Um, with this one, with all of them, I would say to check the sizing chart um, just to make sure that the, the sizing matches up to the size you're buying. I ordered a large for this, which normally I think would work great, but it is a little bit bigger. I can kind of... Especially it. on the sides yeah. too, it it's, kind of billows out a little loose. bit. And I think that could still work how you depending on how you style it, but if you want it to be a little more fitted, size down. And then the sizes that you did on the others and how that worked. Um depend again, depending on how loose or baggy you want them to look, I would size up because i maybe not with the pink one. But the pink no, one, it's. I think it was perfect. I think the pink one was kind of perfect. With the sweater, I would size up if because I felt like it would have been cuter, a little not cuter. I felt like it would have worked better if it was a little baggier, um, which is definitely more what we saw in the photo yes. of it. And so you had actually sized down from what you normally would get for those two. Yes, right. And I think it worked out with the pink sort of denim jacket. Um, but should have just kept it as a, a large for the sweater. So you sized down to medium on the pink and on the sweater. Correct. And probably because it looked so baggy in the picture. Right. I didn't want to be swimming in it. Right. And I wasn't <laughs> with either of those. But it would have been maybe a little more comfortable, a little more what you wanted yeah. if you stayed regular size on right. the sweater. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I think that uh, as far as quality goes, it they did really well with them. It can kind of be hit and miss with denim where you'll think you're getting like a proper denim item, but it's actually like a jegging or something like that. And I felt like they nailed it with this. Yeah, that, that's really, real jean right yeah, there. It's really, and yet with the denim, it's not uncomfortable to move in because sometimes it Which can be a, can be a problem yeah. uh-huh, with denim. Um, especially with the pink shirt, that one just felt really loose and really comfortable and like I could really move in it. Another reason I think to kind of size up or stay at the at the original size. The sweater, we definitely, it came in a package that they kind of vacuumed out the air. So if you're gonna wear it, take it out of the package a couple days early maybe. Just take it out of the package a little bit earlier because it kind of leaves the folded creases in it when you first take it out. So give it a couple days to- And it needs, it needs to fluff up. Yeah, it's definitely got to fluff up. Give it some time to air out. But otherwise, I felt like with the other two, you could just take them right out of the package and wear them. I'm happy to be able to share some of these smaller Amazon stores. We're going to be doing several more of them with women-focused products because that's mainly what this channel is. Guys, if you come here, that's okay. No problem. No worries. You are more than welcome and we are happy to have you. But obviously, we are a more women-focused kind of channel here and I'm going to be doing more of these types of product reviews with some smaller businesses, smaller Amazon stores, not just Amazon stores, but smaller businesses with women-focused products. And especially as we are heading into Mother's Day next month, there's going to be a lot of goodies that I'm really excited about. A lot of them will end up over in the giveaway at The Frugal Family, our main channel. We are doing monthly giveaways over there, so you definitely don't want to miss out. And some of these sponsored items will be included in those monthly giveaways. Not these clothes, however. That was Raquel's payment, her gift for helping me, being my model, letting me just like position her and photogra photographer her, <laughs> photograph her, <laughs> and for her coming all the way down here. Her, her payment was she gets to keep those fabulous clothes. <laughs> Anyway, but some of the other goodies that we will be showcasing, they will be included in the giveaways over there. And then eventually, at some point, when we are like, I don't know, at like 5,000 subscribers here, so please do subscribe, then we will start doing giveaways here on this channel that are, you know, more niche, more focused, just on, you know, women's health, women's 
stuff. I don't know. It's it's going to be happening. Stay tuned. I'm super excited. It feels so good to just be really working again, being a YouTuber again, running three channels. Oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> okay. All right. I just absolutely appreciate you guys watching this. I want to ask you a favor, a couple of favors, actually, if I may. It's the end of my birthday week, so please bear with me. Indulge me. Please subscribe. Please like. Please share. And also, please click on the links in the video description. It just absolutely helps the channel out and gets us, you know, more sponsorships and more of these products that we can then review and share with family, friends, neighbors, and even viewers. Yes, there's going to be a lot of stuff. We have been over on the Frugal Family doing so much decluttering and downsizing and trying to make more use of our space, make our home more livable. We have a big family in a small house. And so I have committed myself to the rule of one in, one out. When stuff comes in, other stuff has to go out. But it's a lot easier if when that stuff comes in, I can just show you, we can enjoy it, we can see it, we can whatever, and then move it right along to family, friends, neighbors, and viewers. My darlings, you have been wonderful. I have been Julie. This has been another Frugal Mama Reviews. If you have a product that you are interested in, that you're looking at, but you're like, I just don't know, and I don't want to spend the money, things are tight right now. I absolutely understand. So if there's something you're looking at and you want me to try it out first, go ahead and tell me in the comments. We also do have a business email down there. We love to give honest, thorough reviews. We're going to tell you what we think. For instance, the sweater, I wish it was a little thicker and I wish it was more true to size. That would have been fabulous. But the other two, the pink and the, and the jean vest, those are just absolutely fantastic. Okay, highly recommend them. Have a beautiful day. We'll see you all real soon.